Hi, my name is Mrinalini. I'll be going through the video for solution on unexpected error when using a full pushdown optimization. The agenda for the video would be just going through what is pushdown optimization when normally used and the main problem I'll be trying to solve is the full pushdown optimization which encounters an unexpected condition on a preview. So generally pushdown optimization is to help push transformation logic for source, target or full mapping to the database. This would be for performance reasons like when you want database to handle large set of data queries. When we try to do a full pushdown, if the transformation logic cannot be handled in a query mm, to the database, we do source or target pushdown, which is a partial pushdown. We can preview the query which is going to be pushed down to the database from the Informatica client. So I will be sh demonstrating a mapping uh, which has uh, been uh, defined for pushdown optimization in the workflow manager and when trying to do a full pushdown optimization preview encounters the unexpected condition and we'll look back to see how to resolve this problem. So I'll be taking to work. So this is the mapping we have been configured for pushdown optimization. So on the mapping tab we see the pushdown optimization and this has been set to full and uh, this is uh, territory source, territory target and a lot of lookups being called from the expression transformation. When I try to do a push down, this um, target and the source exist in the Teradata, so I use a Teradata connection. And when I try to preview, I do get unexpected condition OPT lkup.cpp normally unexpected condition is seen when application cannot handle some kind of logic which is not been mm, reported for exceptions so so looking at this function it, this normally means lkup normally means a lookup so we need to go back and see how the lookups have been defined in the mapping mm, then try to correct um, by isolating which is the lookup causing this problem. So this is the mapping in the mapping designer of uh, Informatica Coin Designer. So we have many unconnected lookups so the challenge is to isolate which lookup transformation is causing the problem uh, so which is going through this unexpected condition. So first we would go to the next questions to see where all the lookup transformation has been called and you can comment out this this is the way you can comment out everything and start using only one and then short listing which is the lookup really mm, causing the problem so I have gone through this and have short, short listed this is the lookup which is the country region out um, region is a lookup which is causing the problem. Mm, now when I go to this transformation I just need to do a sanity check. I need to compare what's the difference between the other lookup to this lookup which is working and I see what uh, what are the is it a problem with the way the error has been reported as how the ports have been defined if you look at this lookup you see there is a written port written port is needed for an unconnected lookup to return the data based on the condition so if I go to the problematic lookup there is no written port defined the lookup to though the lookup port is region so I try to check this box where a written port is needed, save this mapping, then I go to the workflow manager 
to see if I can preview it now. So going back to the workflow manager to check if the change has affected the push down. So I'll go back and try to do the preview results on the Teradata connection again and do a full push down again. So now the push down preview works with the change. So we have fixed the error that was the solution and we can also preview what is the query which is pushed to the database for optimization. So this is the solution for the unexpected condition and particular line number and the function how to kind of go back and check on the mapping to see how we can resolve the push down optimization needs to be considered when a large data set is written from the database uh, so a, a query needs to be executed on a database and a large data set is retrieved that's when we consider push down optimization and we do have quite a information on the knowledge base for um, push down optimization for different errors and we have a velocity documentation which is prescribed for performance and tuning push down optimization is one of the performance feature um, which we can consult this velocity documentation then we have informatica user guide which helps us to refer to the limitations what transmissions cannot be pushed down and uh, what are the specific database supported so uh, hope you like the video please send us the feedback at support videos at informatica.com and also tweet us on info support thank you